What's up everyone, it's Tim here from Tutorials Hub. Now in today's video, I will show you the LLM system and hardware requirements. And can you actually run LLM models locally? So the question, can you actually run LLM models locally will really depend on what LLM you actually want to run. I have a couple of examples right here. So as you can see, one um, person actually asked this on Reddit, I need to run an LLM locally, uh, could be a cloud instance or some VMs, and I would love to have some, uh, and I would have some uh, HV constraints, which I don't know exactly yet. So basically, as you can see right here, uh, this is a really great answer. I do not believe that there is any baseline you can use as a reference. You can, however, go through the system requirements of the LLM you want to self-host and decide based on that. So, for example, guys, I recently made a video on uh, LAMA requirements. So, as you can see, for example, if you want to go and if you want to run LAMA locally, and more specifically, I'm talking about LAMA 3.1 70 billion parameter model, then this is the budget-friendly setup, as you can see right here. So for example, hardware requirements, GPU, right, NVIDIA RTX 4090, 24 gigabytes VRAM, RAM 64 gigabytes, CPU, uh, either Intel i9, which is my personal recommended, or storage, uh, you know, two terabytes of storage. And then what you can do, you can pretty much run four bit quantized versions and expect 10 to 15 tokens per second performance. Now, some limitations are that you cannot run the full model right in fp16 or fp32 and it also has slower response times for complex tasks it's also heavily dependent on quantization tricks to fit within vram so what does this mean guys this is only a budget friendly version set up for llama 3.1 70 billion parameters llm which means that this setup is not enough for this particular model right so as you can see you have 4000 to 6000 setup as well and then you have also 10000 setup as well so again the question what is the llm system and hardware requirements will depend which model you actually want to go and run so for example if i go here and if i say for example let's say i go to quen right and quen has let me just check here so Quen has different models. We have a 72 billion instruct model. So Quen 2.5, 72 billion. So let's say we want to run that. What are system requirements for Quen 72 billion instruct model, right? And then obviously, you know, um, you can also research this yourself. Uh, but as you can see, running the Quen instruct model locally requires substantial computational resources due to its size and architecture. So the lower the parameters, right? So 72 billion is quite a lot more than Llama, which we just, um, you know, which we just um, mentioned here. But the more the, uh, the, more the uh, parameters in billions, the more you will have to spend. So as you can see, right, you have like software requirements, you have, you know, single GPU, like 40 gigabytes VRAM, um, you, know, you have like, uh, you know, for G GPTQ int four, which is four bit quantization. Uh, here you have approximately 41 gigabytes VRAM. So you get the point, right? You know, for each LLM, it will be different, right? Obviously, if you want to run locally, you know, some like easy to use models, it will be much less uh, you know, computational power needed. So for example, right here, we also have one article on recommended hardware for running LLMs locally. So as you can see, running large language models like GPT, BERT, or other transformer-based architectures on local machine has become a key interest. And while cloud-based solutions like AVS, Google Cloud, and Azure offer scalable resources, running LLMs locally provides flexibility, obviously privacy and cost efficiency. So. Obviously, as you can see, however, deploying a training such models requires significant hardware resources, particularly in terms of computational power, memory and storage. So obviously, um, you know, you need specialized hardware for LLMs, right? It's obviously right now a self-explanatory. Um, but again, it will again depend which, you know, LLMs you're running locally, right? Is it, um, you know, LLMs like Quen, like 72 billion model uh, parameters? 
uh, or is it a llama, right? A 3.1, uh, 8 billion, 70 billion parameters, right? If it's 8 billion parameters, you need a much uh, less computational power than, you know, 72 a billion parameters. So uh, yeah, this is basically right it. Now, as you can see, to run LLMs locally, your hardware setup should focus on having a powerful GPU with sufficient VRAM, uh, ample RAM and fast storage, obviously. Um, but again, it depends on which type of LLM you're running. So hopefully this answers your question. I know it's kind of all over the place, but if you have any like specific comments, you can comment below um, and I would be able to answer uh, that question for you. So uh, yeah, guys, uh, if you want to see more AI videos, uh, you know, about these type of topics uh, and also how to automate AI within your own life or business, we have a bunch of videos on that on our channel. Uh, and yeah, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully you find it useful. We'll see you in the next video.